Should we do it? Should we bring back gaming? They said it couldn't be done, folks. They said it couldn't happen. Fancy a cup of tea. So there's a lot of dialogue in the beginning and I'm trying to, I'm going to try to do my very best August to, year. to like, you know, do funny accents and stuff. Cause I was thinking about it. Like, how can I creatively, um, how can I creatively like make this, uh, game be as entertaining as possible. But look, a lot of gaming fans, a lot of gaming Andes have, uh, have, have wondered. You know, what has happened to gaming? Well, it's back in a big way. Hold on. I got to, I got to turn around and, and plug the Nintendo, the Nintendo switch on. Okay. This beginner played Pokemon Legends for seven minutes and quit when he sees it's turn based. Let's go. Not turn based. Wait, is it turn based? I did a sub. Oh, wait, hold on. Let's see if it worked. Oh, it sure is. Certainly did. What is this? Uh oh. I have any juice in. Keep those top of the hour ads out of my face. I didn't charge controllers, but it doesn't matter. Oh shit. Fuck. Sixth month, let's go gaming frogs rise up, let's go. Hold on, I just like fucked everything up. One second. No GPU driver update required. No, 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 none of that, none of that. Chill, chill, none of that. Folks, none of that, okay? I just need to figure out. I just accidentally turned off my, uh, I just, the only thing I fucked up was I accidentally turned off my, my thing. But we're good. We're actually Gucci. Okay, am I too? Right, fucking right. Yeah, too. Wait, what? Uh! Dude, it's been so long since I've fucking uh, gamed that like I forgot how to do this. You know what I mean? We're getting a little crumble of that up here. Okay, so I'm gonna restart this. Because I, I already had started playing. So I don't know how to restart it, though. How do I start from the, to the top? Delete your save data? I don't know how to do that. 
two months with our king has slammed. Delete your delete your switch save data. Restart your game and then Wait, I don't even know how to fucking restart the game to be honest. All right, let's try. Okay. Don't do it on stream. You may share something by accident. Oh, save data is in settings. I can't just like say new game when I start. I have to go to like settings and data manager and shit. Okay. I didn't fucking realize it was going to be that serious, bro. What the fuck? Uh, data management. The thing I want to see this year is Hassan playing League of Legends lol. Wait. Oh, there it is. Pokemon Arceus Legends. Delete save data for Hasanabi. Oh, wow, it's not even letting you do it. No, you don't. God, chat is dumb. You can delete the data from the main screen. It doesn't matter. I just deleted it. I'm an idiot. Um, let's get started from the top again for everyone to fucking enjoy together. You know what I mean? Like, I didn't... I, I wanted to test it out off stream. I wanted to play it a little bit to see what it was like. You know, and and I did. And now we're doing it. Presented by fucking Game Freak, dude. You know who else is a Game Freak? Me. English. So I'll just start off by saying this. I have not played a Pokemon game since. Wait, Chatterino should be underneath the cameras. I have not played a Pokemon game since Pokemon Yellow. Okay, since my Pokemon Yellow was basically stolen. Uh, I, I, like, I played a little bit of Pokemon Go. And from what I understand, this is Arceus, is a godly being. Don't know what the fuck's going on there. Okay, we're just going to pick our appearance now. Uh, I'm going to pick the tan white guy. Surprise. Not a lot of not a lot of versatility here. What is thy name? And I I pick my name as Azad. Or wait, I said Assad when I was playing, but Ozna. No, not Ozna. Azan Pogo. Azan Pogo. Thou, soon thou shalt find thyself in a world strange to thee. A world inhabited by wondrous creatures that the humans call Pokemon. Azan, Pogo. I'm gonna put the cameras up here. Probably better. Let's go. Seek out all Pokemon and thou shalt find me among once more. Anyway, like I said, the last time I played was fucking yellow, okay? So, it's been a minute, okay? I'm a little rusty. Uh, uh, I did play a little bit of Pokemon Go to the polls, you know? Okay. Shouts out to Hillary Clinton. Well, not a phone in sight, dude. So what is happening is I'm falling out of the fucking planet and I, I go back to like a prehistoric era and this is like Pokemon Allah, you know what I mean? I think. I guess Arceus is like the god of Pokemon. It's like I thought Mewtwo was the fucking god of Pokemon or Mew was the god of Pokemon. But I guess it's Arceus that's the, the real god of Pokemon. You know, it should end la ilaha illallah, it should end Muhammad and Abdul Rasulullah, but, uh, you know, I guess there is a God other than uh, Allah, and Muhammad is not the sole prophet, you know what I'm saying? Months with gaming. Let's go. Just saying, like, in this game, which is haram, but wake up! Grab a bush and put a little makeup! Astaghfirullah, by the way. Sorry. Are you alive, my boy? 
So I have no fucking clue what these Pokemons are. So what's up? Did Pokemons change from like, you know, yellow? Like, were, did Pokemons used to look different? In the past, you gave me quite the shock falling from the sky like that, but thank goodness he was even harmed. Who are you, Joe Biden? I'd like to ask you the same. I mean, you fell out of the sky, you understand? Come on now, who in the world does that? Bro, I got the, I got, I'm dripless, dude. I am so dripless. I must say your clothing is unusual. Yeah, even the fucking, even the weird doctors like, bro, you are, you got no drip. No drip, have an ass, motherfucker. You are going to get zero Pokemon pussy. Water starters, bigger hearts. Water starters, bigger hearts. Water starters, bigger hearts. Homie came out with a fucking Pepsi shirt. B being a pickle, yeah. I got i I'm wearing a Pepsi shirt with cargo shorts and the ugliest fucking flip-flops you've ever seen. Might I offer some directions? You have somewhere around here you could stay? No, nowhere. I got nowhere to be, bro. So you don't know anyone here and you don't even know what to spend the night. Well, this is a proper pickle indeed. Why is this old man talking to me about pickles, bro? I don't know what to do. Imagine like the sussiest looking doctor coming at you in the beach and being like, I'm an old man here. This is uh, let's talk about pickles. I see. Well, no gentleman would abandon such a person in need. Why does yo that Pokemon in the middle has a bra? By the way, uh, that that Pokemon is wearing a bra. Oh my! I completely forgot. I just caught up these three runaway Pokemon when you tumbled out of the sky. It's almost like they knew you'd appear here. Ah, but do you even know what a Pokemon is? I'm saying, of course. Oh, I said not exactly. You, you don't? You truly have traveled a long way. Well, these three are what we call Pokemon. Where are mysterious creatures, you see? Marvelous. Hey, what's good, dude? Oh, yes. Hey. What might your name be? Yo, what's up, dude? Here, you want to sit? Oh, yeah. Here, you just want my keys, right? Outside. Uh, and here, say hi to the say hi to chat real quick. My chat. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Look at this, look at this, look at this. I, I caught that. Oh my god, that was athletic. That my was bad. athletic. That was really athletic. Good job. Sorry, what's up? Uh, what am I looking at? Wait, hold on. Did we do this right? Oh, here it is. Okay. Say hi to the chat. Hi, chat. Um, uh, Mythological's taking my car right now. Uh, yeah, I just started Pokemons. The new Pokemons. Dude, that's sick. You've it never played Pokemon. Sick. I've never played a single Pokemon I've game. I've only played one Pokemon game, and like that was many, many years ago. It was like when you were literally just being born. Wait, so. uh, what, what year did it come out? What? Did it come out in 99? I don't know. When did Pokemon Yellow come out, chat? Let's take a look real quick. Oh, in chat. Augers, you guys are hyper in chat. Let's go. Pokemon Nine, Yellow. No, I wasn't even conceived. Oh my god, what, the last time I played Pokemon, <laughs> you were literally, your parents were having sex, dude. No, they were, they were, yeah. 1998, were oh my god, last time I played Pokemon, you were not alive! They were thumping, what? they were probably fucking in bed. Oh. While you were while you were selecting your starter Pokemon. <laughs> oh my god, bro, I was seven, dude, that's crazy. <laughs> Okay, where are your keys? You got them? Or there? Okay. On the on the ring like hanger thing up there. Gotcha. I'll be back later. Um, but yeah, All I'm right. gonna go work out. Bear All back. right, go go lift, bro. Bye, chat. Bro, that's crazy. Last time I played Pokemon, I was y'all were most of you were not alive in the chat. That's crazy to me. Woo. Okay. Oh yeah, that's what what your name be? Oh uh ho, -huh, so you're called a son? That name has quite a ring to it. I imagine it must have some lovely meaning. Yeah, little do you know, doctor, it does. Oh, but I do apologize. I haven't even introduced myself. My name is Leventon. I am something of a Pokemon professor. Bro, this is what happens, okay, when Liptards take over and then they give professorships and PhDs to like gender studies and Pokemon studies, okay? Why don't you get a STEM job, bro? What's up? Imagine being... Oh, hold on here. I'll, I'll turn this off. Imagine being a fucking... Imagine being a fucking, uh, you know, professor of Pokemon, dude. 
Oh, you couldn't find it? Oh, you're still in one of my waters? Okay. That is to say, I'm a scholar seeking to deepen our understanding of Pokemon. Dude, honestly, they could have. Yes, Pokemon such as these creatures. Oh no, they're running away. Dude, this is literally like. In modern day, this guy would go on the Joe Rogan show. Pokemon professor is a STEM job. Yeah, right, dude. Get out of here. Oh. Oh, blast and bother. My darling Pokemon. Must you run for me again? I'm terribly sorry, but do. Could you help me round them up? I beg you. Dude, look at this guy. Professor Balaklava is asking a random child that just fell out of the fucking hole in the sky. Which, oh, right there, apparently. How to fucking catch the Pokemons that just ran away. Are you serious? Also, I can't jump, which is annoying. There's a glowing beeping object there. All right, this is my... This is my smartphone. This is where I will be texting zero bitches, okay? You found something that resembles a phone. It's probably your phone, but it's changed save. You feel a strange power emanating from it. <laughs> a devious lick appeared, dude. <laughs> I bestow upon thee this arc po- <laughs> What the fuck? This arc found in thy mission to seek out all Pokemon. Why is- why, Is it because this is supposed to be the olden days? That's why it's like Shakespearean? Like, I got a fucking smartphone. Which, uh, I guess exists in this time period. Alas, yet another miss. Aha! I'm glad you've come to rescue my new friend from the sky. I tried catching my little runaways by tossing some Pokeballs they were, but I'm not the best at this sort of thing, you see. I'd love to give you a go at it, but perhaps I should tell you a bit about these three first. Now that's a Rowlet. Rowlet can photosynthesize like a plant and apparently it battles using his sharp feathers. Dude, this looks like a bitch, dude. What is he battling, dude? That one right there is a Syndequil, which sounds like a proprietary drug that you take when you have allergies. The fire burning on Syndequil's back will flare up when it's surprised or irate. Foom! I think Syndical is what I would pick as a starter. If I, I assume I'm gonna pick one of these three, right? Oshawott. Naps while floating on water and it can use, <laughs> you can battle using the shell-like object on its belly. Okay. Dude, is this like, did they revert? I mean, did they, did they not revert, but like, I feel like this is more baby-like than the other Pokemon games or maybe because I was seven when I played Pokemon. Here you are, my boy. Pokeballs. Now throw these Pokemon to catch them. A mysterious ball can be thrown at a wild Pokemon in order to catch them. These balls can be crafted by hand if you gather the necessary materials. Ah, but that won't do for an explanation, will it? I do apologize. Let me be more thorough. Now, I've mentioned that already the Pokemon are strange, marvelous creatures. What's so strange about them, you ask? Well, each and every Pokemon is able to shrink itself down to a minuscule size. Also, 50 is a lot, dude. Wait, wait. So Pokemon, this entire time, Pokemon just mysteriously had a magical ability to get small and it wasn't the Pokeballs doing? Since when, bro? What the fuck? They just lore dumped in the beginning of Arceus like this? Pokeballs are a recent invention, usually. All right, the Pokemon will shrink down and fit inside the ball. Comfy as can be. Oh, dude, what the fuck? Dude, wait, why would they want to run away then, if that's the case? Why do you have to beat their asses if they're shrinking personally? I know we've just met, but I'm afraid I have no one else to turn to. I just got back from the Lolita Express, along with Bill, <laughs> Bill, Gla Bill Gates. We talked to Jeffrey Epstein. And he also had no answer to enslaving Pokemons. I'll, I'd be awfully grateful if you could catch my three runaways. Now, the proper technique is to take aim at the Pokemon and then let the ball fly. It's quite simple, you see. So far be it for me to say so, I suppose I've given my own dad like a, like a skill in the, in the area. 
Okay, got it, got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's fucking easy peasy, dude. I, I got this. Okay, watch this. Watch this shit. Boom! Get fucked, bitch. Yeah, that's right. Give it to me. Yeah, that's right. Oh, yeah. It seems you have quite the knack for this Pokemon catching business, Azan. Jolly useful skill to have you around here. This motherfucker said child labor is poggers. Only two of my darling runaways left now. Yeah, I'm not fearful of Pokemon because they look like little babies, dude. Why would I be fearful of Pokemons when they look more baby-like than ever before? Oh, no! He, he noticed me. Let's go, Chardaquil. Do you want to pull your starter choice, by the way, or nah? Do I have to pick one of these three? Then I'm going to go with the, the NyQuil one. You know, many people fear to even approach Pokemon, never mind catching them. Bravo, indeed. Just one more to go. Let's wrap up the sharpish, shall we? Sharpish. A lot of, t a lot of attitude for... Let's wrap up this sharpish is, is fucking wild. So, I'm not gonna be able to catch him at first, right? Like, I mean, obviously. Yeah, there it is. Ah, oh, yes! They're hardly 100% foolproof. Give it another go, old boy. There you go. I'm not even looking. That's a, that's a, that's a look back. You see that? Kobe. Straight up. R.I.P. You see, the three Pokemon you have caught have only just arrived at the village to help with our research. They won't listen to anyone. Calling my favorite starter NyQuil is probably the worst thing you've ever done to me. I mean, it is NyQuil. So, Chatters, did you see this? these Pokemons already? As I mentioned, they bolted from the village almost as you knew they'd you'd come falling. But I must say, Azan, taken aback by how well you use Pokeballs. Dude, old man, that's sus as fuck, bro. Old man talking to a young boy saying how you know how to play with balls. This is really sus. How is that you catch Pokemon so ably when you've only just arrived here? One can't help but think there's a reason you have appeared here and now. I mean, there's been like a million different Pokemon games, so. Games have been leaked on torrents for like five whole days now. Gen 2, Gen 5, and Gen 7 starters. There are 900. Seek out all Pokemon. An object is an arc phone, you say? What an old device could be guiding you somehow. I liked it when they were like five. How many were there? Gotta catch them all. There was like 300 or something. If you indulge me. Something I'd like to. You see, I have a dream to compile this region's first com Pokedex. Yes, the proper Pokedex is a wonderful work of research containing detailed records of all Pokemon. Bro. The first one was 151 in the original, uh, 151 original Pokemon. Back then, we had to compile a Pokedex. So what happened? This dumbass couldn't compile the Pokedex? He was like, bro. Ash Ketchum all is trying to fucking catch them all since... Like, every, every version, every variant of Pokemon, there's like more of them all of a sudden. And you still don't have a fucking Pokedex. At least in this one, it makes sense that the Pokedex is, like, not full because it's just starting. And to you, a person with clear talent for catching Pokemons. Your goal is to seek out every Pokemon and mine is to have all those Pokemon caught. A situation right for teamwork, don't you agree? Come now, what do you have to say? Shall we help or not or out, my boy? And whoever and from wherever you may be, I welcome you with open arms. We have Pokedex to complete. This is called child labor, bro. All right, give me some proper clothes. Yeah, I'm fucking dripless. He said, yo, on God, we're going to get you some pussy. My boy, you, you look, you are not dripped out at all.
catch them all was American slogan for marketing. It isn't mentioned at all in the game's original. Thank you for your tireless work, keeping us safe, good godsmen. What's he gonna do, bro? What's that guard gonna do against NyQuil? If NyQuil comes over and tries to fucking blast them with fire, what's he gonna do, bro? He's fucking... His... His mustache is gonna catch on fire. Does he have a blicky? Bro, it's so funny that there's just like this gigantic black hole on top of this scary mountain and everybody's just chilling. Like, I bet the doctor, I bet Dr. Lavington is a denier of like the mountain's danger. You know what I mean? He's like one of those like chiropractor ass doctors. This village was built two years ago. There's much to do yet, not many to do it. Everybody's making fun of my outfits, dude. Does the professor know that child? Good question, ma'am. You're right. Does he know me? No. Can you help me? Can you help me? Where are the authorities? This old man is is saying I gotta grab his he gave me 50 balls, said I'm very good with that I'm very good with touching balls and shit. Please save me. Oh, botheration! I'd almost forgotten. Need to go and report that successfully recovered the escaped Pokemon. Might I ask you to wait for me at the canteen? So, <laughs> why is the doctor the only one with modern drip, by the way? Somehow it seems to show where you need to go next. Kind of fucked up that. Yo, what's up, guys? I'm just trying to be friends. This region is huge. There's lots of dangerous Pokemon, too, but you came here anyway. How come? Waka. Back in my hometown, I got an older brother who's going to inherit the family's farm and all, but I'm going to make my own way here in Hisui. Bro, you are literally three. Make your own way to what? Can you get in the water? No, you can't. He's like, bro, I can't wait to do work. Okay. Second born son, Sag. Yeah, dude, that's totally how it works still in this in modern day. Well, now, aren't you awfully suspicious? Dude, I'm a kid. The wallflowers for galaxy team folk only. We don't have to seat for outsiders. Move along. Dude, he just got... Bro, what the fuck? He, he's like, he's like being racist to a kid. I've never seen anyone dressed like you are. What if you were attacked by a Pokemon? You'd be minced meat in those flimsy clothes. See, even the girl's like, yo, you got no drip. Perhaps you've met Professor Leventon. He's a scholar from a faraway place. His Pokemon do get away from him at times, though. Makes me a bit worried for him. I suppose I'm hardly one to talk. I've had some trouble with Pokemon myself. I was hit by a Pokemon move called Thundershock not long ago and had to take to my bed. Oh, she got fucking... Oh, she got owned. Oh, she got blasted. She got Ugg boots on. That's a basic white girl for Arceus. You know, circa 1774. Whenever the fuck this is. Even back then, white women were wearing Ugg boots. Unfortunately, it's just as Akari says. I'm a clumsy sort of fellow, to put it mildly. But everything will be quite all right now. Asan here has agreed to help us with our Pokedex. By the way, I'm quite literally wearing Uggs right now. I I'm wearing Ugg slippies. Excuse me, you plan to appoint him to the survey corps? You can't just slap a badge on whoever you like without Captain Celine's permission. I'll allow it. Wow, Captain Celine is queer coded, dude. Okay. She got no eyebrows, though. That's kind of weird. Assuming the individual can contribute to the Survey Corps, that is. I am the captain of Galaxy Team Survey Corps. You may call me Celine. Why is she so mad? Oh, she got the Ugg boots on too. 
That's a girl boss, dude. Professor Laventon has told me how you helped secure his Pokemon when they slipped his control. And now it seems he would like us to feed and house you in exchange for your ongoing labor. Oh my god, they're straight up saying child labor, dude. <laughs> That's a perfect age to exploit. You look to be about 15. Quite old enough to work for your keep. Yo, Japanese people are crazy, dude. I swear to God. What are your skills or your origins? Tomorrow we shall see if you can prove yourself worthy. Oh, Jesus Christ. Now, would you care to join us for a meal? I'm sure you've got plenty of questions for our visitor. What did you say? I told you nothing in Pokemon makes any sense. That's quite all right. I prefer to eat alone. So I might appreciate my meals without distraction. This is the, yeah, this is the maternal Bastianich. Aloof, as always, I see. Well, no matter. The rest of us can share a meal and some pleasant conversation then, eh? Benny, old chum. The usual potato mochi, if you please, but make it for three today. Oh, what's up? Benny's now no longer racist. Wonderful stuff, Benny. Much obliged. Your potato mochi never fails to please. Penny's like, I spat in the, I spat in the foreigner's food. Professor Laventon, well, exactly did you meet our visitor here? Ah, well, you know of that great hole in the sky, the one that people call the space-time rift, it's fake. Nothing bad happens there. I'm going out the Joe Rogan experience soon to talk about it. See, our friend fell right out of it. You can't be serious. Come now, I'm a scientist. Everyone keeps saying I'm just a chiropractor, but my job is to observe and explain any and all phenomena. I concern myself only with facts. Now you already know there are many Pokemon here in the Hisui region. And that there are in the grass, in the forest, by the water, or wherever they like. <laughs> Our job is a survey course to research them and find out what kind of creatures- I can't do that voice. <clears throat> well, we know this much. Pokemon are terrifying creatures. It's all but impossible to know what kinds of powers they might possess, or what sorts of wondrous things they can do. But that's where Azan will come in. He successfully caught three Pokemon, three of them in quick order, you understand. Nobody in the Galaxy team is capable of feats such as that. Oh, damn. Galaxy team is just a bunch of broke bitches, dude. They can't even fucking catch three Pokemons in a row. Get the fuck out of here, dude. You guys suck. Maybe they do need me. Um... This means we can finally begin our Pokemon research. Three? We've had a hard time catching even one wild Pokemon come after us. Ah, well, to be perfectly fair, the Pokemon that fled to the beach weren't on the attack, but the key to catching Pokemon is getting close enough to aim your Pokeball well, and it seems our new friend is fearless enough to just do that. Does oh, Benny about to be racist. Does the Survey Corps really have leeway to be enjoying a leisurely meal with this outsider? Oh my god, just say it. Just say it, dude. Just fucking say it, Benny, okay? I bet he, he's not from around this region, that's right, I got... Like, he's talking so much shit for a dude with a green mustache. Like, bro, you literally picked up a celery and put it on your, your face. It doesn't even match the rest of your, you know, facial hair. Like, how about you fucking focus on your celery mustache, okay? Your captain just ordered 10 whole portions of potato mochi, you know? Slow progress on that Pokedex of yours clearly has her on her edge. Oh, damn. She is, okay, she's queer coded and she's neurodivergent. Let's go. I'm sure we'll start to rein in the good captain's stress eating soon enough. Now let's have your fill, Azan. And think, if you make it into the galaxy team, you'll never have to worry about a meal again. The team provides for all of its members' needs, even if said members fell out of the sky. Benny was like, I make rib corn around these parts, but sometimes I make potato maki. That was quite delicious, quite delicious indeed. Oh yes, the food was lovely, but more importantly, do you remember that Azan has a trial to pass? Not to worry, I have complete confidence in his own skills. Bro, how do you look at a man? Oh shit, she's back. Let's hope it's not misplaced. Azan, was it? 
For tonight at least, we will provide you with a place to sleep. For tonight at least. He's like, oh, you want shelter? You got to fucking work for it, slave. And also, even that's conditional, okay? But if you fail to pass the trial we put you up tomorrow, you must move on. You will be expelled from the village to meet your fate and perhaps your death in the wild? Bro, I'm 15. OMG Gaming is back. They literally are like, you're, you know, this is a polka serfdom, dude. Captain Celine somewhat like Hisui in that they're both quite harsh. Now, now, she simply puts on a stone front to help keep us all safe. At any rate, I think it's time we turned in for the night, eh? Good thing one can't fall out of the futons we sleep in here. I imagine our new friend has enough falling for one day. And with that, I bid you both a good night. Yes, good night. She says survive. She said work for me or die. A rift in the sky. People falling from it. The world is full of mysteries. Head to the Survey Corps' quarters you've been assigned to. Okay, wait, I want to see what the- this dude has like a funny-ass outfit. His name is Beauregard. Commander Kamado is fantastically strong. You Rumor has it. He wants to send a Pokemon flying with one of those sumo throws he's so proud of. Wait, what? Oh my god, are Pokemon catching hands in this? Are Pokemon about to- am I about to fuck Pokemon up with my hands? Because this is crazy. Oh, that's so sick. That's so sick. Okay, that's fire, dude. Nice fire in the sunken hearth to keep the entire room heated. A jug used to store drinking water is a lid on top to keep from debris falling in. What is this? Books? Checking survey tips. Survey tips contain useful information. They only carry out your survey work in the Hisui region to read them at any time. Press, simply, uh, press the up button. Don't wish your tolls be forgotten. Save record keeping will save you from such diligent record keeping. Save your progress. Press the up button and scroll the ZR, ZR button until you reach the save screen. What are the haters doing in here? They're like, uh huh, the fucking graphics are worse than the... The graphics are worse than the fucking Wii version. This chest looks like you can store lots of lost items in it. Bro, I mean, this is like kind of good. It's like... Many of you would, would take on a serfdom if that meant like this level of, of security. Like, this is a big ass house. It's even heated, you know what I mean? You got, you got house, you got heat in your house. Behave with courtesy to others. Superiors are owed your respect. Likes and dislikes are a luxury ill afforded. Those who are weaker must be helped. Except for those who literally can't do anything for the Survey Corps. They die. Difficulties must be faced head on. Wait, I can't change my fit? Dude, I want to wear this. This is drippy as fuck. I want some fucking Demon Slayer fits, dude. You know what I'm talking about? That's kind of been the fandom lately. They gripe about graphics. Okay, well, they should chill the fuck out, dude. Just enjoy the game. Shut up. Gaming, let's go. Good morning, Azan. Are you up? Quite some lightning last night, was it? Today's the last day of your trial, so let's give it our all. Wait, Akari is the the woman, right? The chick. Akari. 
Bro, those clothes must be so stanky, dude. Imagine falling out of an intergalactic space portal in the same fit, and you still got the fucking you still got the the Beauregard cargos on. At least I mean he's got cargo though because it's like you know he, he can fit fifty pokeballs in there. Captain Selene is waiting. Dude, I did. I am so dripless. I need. I need to get drip. Like, look at these shoes, bro. Look at these fucking shoes, dude. These are. This is the wackest fit of. This is literally. This is the wackest fit of 1378. Whenever this year, the, this game, whenever this uh, the the Hisu region is is placed in. My man's got fucking slippers on, dude. It's so bad. How are you gonna catch Pokemon with the slippers that keep slipping out of your feet? White boy goaded with the sauce? Yeah, he is. Azan is a quirked up white boy goaded on the goaded with the sauce. Sir Wick Corps offices are on the first floor. Don't give up. Keep those eyes open. Wild Pokemon, they they're everywhere. Attacking from all sides. I sent my partner Pokemon, but against the whole pack, outnumbered. This is what happens when you go so far afield. Medical Corps will put you to right. Yeah, I got some rights and some fucking lefts for these Pokemon. You know what I'm saying? Dude, I can't wait to beat some Pokemon ass. Without a partner Pokemon of your own, you might find this trial particularly trying. I got equal rights and equal lefts for these Pokemon. They can catch these hands, dude. I cannot wait to beat ass. Selene is always angry. Damn, bro. 1374 and they got free healthcare. 2022 in America. You still don't, dude. Imagine. These motherfuckers got so much healthcare that they have free vet care, bro. I'm just saying. Think about that. They literally can take care of your pets for free. If you wish to join the galaxy expedition team, prove yourself capable by going out into the obsidian field lands and catching three different species of Pokemon. Bidoof, Stali, and Shinx. Okay, these are made up. No one, that's not a thing. What? That's a species? Shinx? What the fuck does that mean? Catching three Pokemon from the start? No one in the galaxy team has ever managed that. Did this stranger not catch three different Pokemon yesterday? My trial should be simple enough for him. The professor wasn't exaggerating things, that is. Yo! Bro, let me get that abracadabra, bro. Let, yo, let's go. I know that one. If you wish to say, you must prove beyond a doubt you'll be an asset to our cause. This is what the future left this want, dude. This is just the abra? Okay, shut up. Whatever. The fucking baby abracadabra. I will lend you one of our co survey course satchels to carry whatever you may need in the field. People in the chat are like, actually, it's abra. Okay, bro, you're a nerd. Shut up. Akari. I expect you to step in if anything goes awry. Press the Y button while consulting the map on your ARC phone. You can check the task you have waiting. There are two types of missions, missions and requests. Okay, got it. Pardon Azan. Come with me a moment. It's literally canon that in the past people used to fuck Pokemon. I think they say in the gold, uh, gold slash silver Pokemussy. Now then, a jolly good morning to everyone. Is something the matter, Professor Laventon? In order to complete our Pokedex and well simply survive in this unforgiving, Azan must pass this trial. I've got the ticket to help accomplish that. Chad, I'm going with the fucking. I'm going with Nyquil, right? What do you guys think? I like that one. This one is the, the other two are too whack. Like at least the Nyquil ones got look like he looks cool. I'm gonna go with the fire one. Has buffed back to gammon, boys. A lot of people saying Rowlet, some people saying owl. Why bird? 
Bro, the bird has a bra on, dude. I will eat the bird, okay? NyQuil Final Evolution sucks. NyQuil and Oshawott are good. Edgy 16 year old wants the fire one. Certified freak seven days a week. This is crazy. I can't believe this is happening. OMG, my uncle overheard us on gaming and walked over to check it out. But the thing, he hasn't walked for 25 years and since an incident during Operation Desert Storm. He was so moved by Hassan's return to gaming that he was able to walk again. God damn, I love this community. <laughs> Dude, that's literally an owl in a bow tie. How the fuck is this a debate? I want NyQuil, but I don't want to get cucked in its final Evo if it's not good. Well, my boy, which Pokemon would you like to keep as your very own? Is he going to tell me stats? Nickel gets owned by rollout in the early game. Fuck it, I'm going with Nyquil, dude. Fuck it. How do you guys know like early game stats already? And with that, one of the Pokemon you caught at Prelude Beach. <laughs> the beach is called Prelude Breach? Are you fucking kidding me? A word of advice, my boy. Pay close attention to which Pokeballs are empty and which ones contain a Pokemon when you're out on the field. Bro, give me the other ones too then. What do you mean, you fucking selfish bitch? What do you mean? He's like, I'm gonna do research on them? What kind of research is he gonna do? Oh my god. Oh my god, it's Dr. Anthony Fauci. Oh my god, Laventon is Dr. Anthony Fauci. He's gonna strangle them. Like, fa like Fauci strangled the fucking beagles, dude. Oh my god, get away from those- Get away from those Pokemons. By the way, what species does Captain Celine charge you with changing? Keeps giving me balls, dude. Oh, wow. Last time when I had to catch Pokemons for him, he gave me fucking 50. But now he's like, here, only take 20. Okay. You'll have to leave the village for your trial. Turn left after you exit headquarters and head for the gate. Why are you telling me that? Aren't you coming with me? Is Akari just dropping me like a bad habit or what? What's up, homie? Mystery kid? Can I steal shit? Yo, I'm trying to deviously lick this Abra, you know what I'm saying? No, deviously lick, like steal the Abra by throwing a Pokeball at it. Not like literally lick the fucking Abra. Fine. What the fuck? Okay, this dude looks like a Crusader with a fucking, uh, you know, Yankee with a brim. What do you mean I have a curious getup? What about this, dude? You look like a Knight of the Templar, but then you're wearing like a fucking... 
You're wearing like a fast food chain hat. I'm Volo of the Ginkgo Guild, the go-to choice for any of your mercantile needs here in Hisui. I've heard talk about you. Fell from the sky, didn't you? Now that's certainly a tale I'd like to hear. Oh, and you've a Pokemons. You're certainly full of interesting surprises. Investigating the earth and newel is key to any good merchant success, so what do you say? How about you and I see how our Pokemon stand up to one another in battles? Let's do it. Damn, Volo's like, I will beat your ass first before you go out there. Though I hope you know you lose if your Pokemon's HP reaches the zero. Yo, we got the anime bars. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> That's a bitch made ass Pokemon, dude. Okay, so how do we fight now? Is it turn based still? Wait, what? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god, dude, that's a lot of fucking... Hit him again. Hit him hard this time. Come on, critical hit. Yo, d dude, you cannot lose to a fucking egg, bro. Come on. One more. Oh, get fucked, egg boy! Get fucking blasted, get beaked by my superior Pokemon and his NyQuil fire powers! Let's fucking go! And I just leveled up, and I got a new move. Oh my god, dude. It's always good fun to have your Pokemons do the battle, don't you think? And as they gain experience through the battle, they'll learn more moves and grow even stronger. If you want to change moves, the Pokemon can use in the battle, open your satchel, choose the Pokemon you want, and select change moves option. But so few people here have their own Pokemons. Uh, if only more people knew how to use the Pokeballs. Let me help our two battlers recover from their little exercise. And to you, my Skyfallen friend, I present some potions and thanks. Potion is a topical medicine meant to apply to be Pokemons. Yo, he's the Norwegian Michael Vick. Dude, this is the Michael Vick game. I'll be hoping that you're successful in that trial of yours. More Galaxy Team members means more customers for yours truly after all. Damn, capitalist. That's that pokey ivermectin? Yeah, Dr. Laventine is like, yo, you should take that potion for yourself. Dr. Dr. Laventine is going to be like, dude, the potions, they're, you know, you, sh you should try it for humans too. When you're leaving Jubilee Village, make sure you choose a destination for your map and tell the rest of the guards what you're doing. That way someone can go to your aid if you're knocked out by a Pokemons. Your trial begins just a few short way past that gate. Wait, let me do the thing. Uh, no, not that. How do I do the thing? Wait, first of all, we got to save, right? Uh, but also... Uh... Antidotes cure COVID and don't cure myocarditis. Okay, so he cured my Pokemons, which is good. Change moves, right? Oh, dude! Ember, let's go! Okay, so... Oh, I, I only have a limited amount of moves. And so I don't even have four moves yet, so it's fine. It's already in. Okay, dude, sick. I got a fire move now. What's up, bitch? You're as I'm correct. I was informed you'd be passing through. Your trial will take place outside the safety of the village. Please take care to come back alive. I'm going to name it NyQuil. Hold on. I actually never named Pokemons because I, f I felt like that, like, you know, destroyed the integrity. I was a purist when I was seven. Is anyone else like that or is it just me? 
This is our base camp, last safe haven before you reach the wild. For your trial, you must catch these three species of Pokemon. Bidoof, Starly, and Shinx. Bro, the, the last one just sounds like a hate speech. Are you ready to get started? Oh, Professor, is something wrong? Yo, bro, get off my ass, dude. Ah, well, you see, Captain Saline got hold of me after you left. She impressed upon me that I bear full responsibility for whatever happens to our sudden guest. To be honest, my dear girl, I don't intend to leave to finger, as our talents are the real deal. He'll pass with flying colors, you'll see. Ah, oh, so the responsibility for him still lies in fact with me then. Well, I'm sure Azan will be fine. Let's begin the trial. 